Well, this weekend, high school basketball teams from across the country are gathering at Cathedral Preps Event Center to battle for the crown in the annual Burger King Classic. And the tournament draws more than players. It also draws in families and fans who spend money at local businesses. Our Tom Kowalski stopped by the tournament earlier tonight to see just what the teams and their supporters are doing when they're not on the court. Hi, Tom. I like it. Dozens of players and coaches and fans showed up to support their teams in the famous basketball tournament. But though all those people have to eat, sleep, and find something to do in the city of Erie, and Erie's local businesses are glad to give them that opportunity. For 39 years, the Burger King Classic has brought in some of the best high school basketball teams from across the country to battle for the championship. And this year, teams from as far as Chicago and Philadelphia are playing each other right here in Erie at Cathedral Prep. So what does this tournament mean to players like Brandon Cummings? It means a lot. Uh, I know this, 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 this tournament has a lot of history, uh, and I'm glad to be a part of that history. And uh, My team, my coaches are all glad to be a part of that history, and it's been a great experience all throughout. And other teams say that Erie has been a nice change of scenery. You don't see gyms like this in high school basketball, in high school environment. So being our kids coming in here, and it, the, the, the tournament in general, whether it's uh, a team meal and a buffet or a mass, like it's just very professional. So you know, for the guys to be here and have that experience, in Erie and not in Buffalo is, is pretty cool. But between their busy schedules, Mike Berinsky of Lincoln Park says the teams have the chance to see some of Erie's local attractions, like Splash Lagoon. They went over there and uh, were able to, you know, have fun for the for uh, the day. The first day that we were here, we uh, went to Burger King, obviously. We took a ride around Peach Street and got to see some of the different things. Got to see so when they were here without me, uh, they could walk around and uh, look at a lot of different things. And next time they're in town, Brinsky says they hope to see a bit more of the city. Erie is a little gem, I think. I think it's a, you know, a nice place. We're, we're hoping to come back. We're hoping to come back maybe, maybe and play a couple games other than this tournament, maybe next year. Now we'll have more on the Burger King Classic, including the championship team, in just a few minutes on Erie Sports Now. Live from the studio, Tom Kowalski, Erie News Now.